I haven't talked to anybody and I haven't posted anything in forever. I haven't posted a, a TikTok on Thursday in almost, I think, a year because of the uh, past and future Amber thing. But I stopped doing that because, one, I didn't have time to do it with the new job, which I'll get to later. And two, I, don't, I feel like it maybe wasn't worth it. Because not many people were watching and a lot of people didn't really catch on to it and it didn't just, it didn't transfer over like my followers from my one page to the other page so it just wasn't uh, a successful transition. Three, because I was looking back on some things that happened last year and I'm like well I definitely don't want to talk about that, I definitely don't want to expose that and whatever so it's kind of uncomfortable for me to address certain things that happened last year so I decided to kind of just leave that project behind. I work in the city now. I am no longer at the TV station, if anyone was wondering. Um, my friend Jen asked me the other day and I said, no, I am not with the station anymore. And my my former coworker that worked with me at the station was like, do you miss working at the station? And I kind of was like, uh, no. If I were to describe my position, it'd be like 18 different things. So, but technically I'm acquisitions, film acquisitions, but I do a, low, a whole, crap load of other stuff. Um, because it's a small company, I wear many hats, which is great. I guess for my resume, I don't know. Eva is almost a year old. This is as big as she's gonna get. She's almost a year. I think, well, we, we talked, I think we declared her birthday 1125, so she's gonna be a year old and she's looking out the window like something's going on. Baby dog. I don't drink wine. I don't know, maybe too much wine drinking on New Year's Eve last New Year's Eve. And I kind of never went back to drink wine. 2013 was a wine drinking year and 2014 definitely has not been a wine drinking year nor a drinking year. I need to drink more. I no longer work at the cafe, which is kind of a bummer. I saw Birdman this weekend. Go see Birdman, it's pretty awesome. I'm just gonna address my hometown Buffalo. I know that they're getting tons of friggin' snow. It's crazy how much snow they're getting. Like, some people are saying five feet, some people are saying six feet, seven feet, eight feet, 15 feet of snow. They're supposed to get more snow, and it's freezing outside right now, but Sunday is supposed to get up to like 50 some degrees. I'm in the city, we, it's just been bitter cold. There's no, uh, no snow whatsoever. Tell my people in Buffalo, uh, my family, I talked to them uh, a lot yesterday to make sure they were okay and everything. Just everyone in Buffalo, I hope you're staying safe. Make sure you don't freeze to death and get like trapped in a car in a snowbank or something. Like, let's be smart people. Dyed my hair, it is uh, black now. I don't know if you can see, my roots are coming in, I have to dye it again. That's how long it's been since I've changed my hair color. And my hair is getting longer. I have decided to grow it out. Just in case anyone cared, I don't know. Me and my boyfriend are moving across the hall. We're making a giant leap across the hall into another apartment um, in December. Because it's bigger for not that much money. Like we're talking like a very, very small price difference, which is awesome. You know, more windows, more sunshine, and like a little bit more space so I can put more shit on the walls and stuff. Amber Sherman Photography, what is the, what is going on with that? There is a thumb box exhibition with Selma Gundy. I have not stopped working in photography, although at my new job I don't really have time to shoot or edit new things, but I do have product that I could exhibit. I'm hoping to get into this Chelsea Gallery in December, which I haven't heard back yet. And the thumb box, what thumb box is, is really small art. Like, there's like a size limit that it's like this big or like this big, not like huge fucking pieces of art. It's like small, like petite. <laughs> oh, you can't see her, she's off camera, but she's like rolling around. I think you can see her little legs over there, her little legs. <laughs> So I want to wish everyone a happy Thanksgiving because Thanksgiving is coming up next week. Great home life. I have a cool, uh, uh, I have a, a supportive boyfriend. I have an awesome dog. Um, I don't know, like I have a job that I want. Um, I have Saturday mornings off. That's great. I don't have to work on Saturday mornings anymore. I'm sure everyone has like a really heartfelt Thanksgiving message they could give and I'm just not good at those things, I guess. I'm just uh, a little random. I saw Interstellar. 
I thought it was awesome. Some people are hating on Interstellar, which I don't like, but whatever. I have not even started thinking about Christmas shopping or what's on what list or, or who I'm getting what or what I'm getting who or whatever. I, don't, I just don't want to deal with Christmas shopping right now. I have no idea what I'm doing for New Year's this year. I'm going home for Christmas. My traditional ice skating in Buffalo on um, Christmas Eve with my family. Well, most of my niece and nephews, but my boyfriend is joining us this time. I don't know if my sister and her boyf or her boyfriend is gonna join us. I have no idea. I have like no time to like look at news, or else I'd probably address the Ebola thing. Don't use hand sanitizer because it makes super bugs. And I will, I swear to God, if anyone has any questions about this, I will back this up. There's like CDC stuff and like documentaries about super infections that you can get from using hand sanitizers and the super bugs that hand sanitizers are creating and stuff. Just wash your hands, people. Just wash your hands. It's not hard. Like. I don't know, like people should be scared of all kinds of things, not just Ebola. I've gotten like really bad at making these videos. I haven't made one in so long. So I'm just gonna keep rambling on. Um, I hope people enjoyed it. Uh, I've been thinking about making short films. My boyfriend's gotta get on writing a script because he's a better writer than me. So I guess that's it.